AIDS and HIV, they were secret words hidden from public conversation for decades. But today, thousands are tweeting about World AIDS Day, raising awareness about a virus that no longer is a death sentence. ABC 2's Cassie Carlisle went to Coppin State University, where they tested anyone who walked in for free. Yes, yeah, students are telling me the stigma has changed when it comes to HIV testing and that they're doing this to keep their bodies safe. HIV and AIDS, the words and virus go hand in hand. At Coppin State University, students and faculty are working to ensure education comes with it. Last year, we got close, we got almost close to 100 students uh, and community members. History of STDs. <laughs> It's a very personal test involving a slew of questions so healthcare company Chase Brexton can get a better idea of where they need to focus attention. In exchange, they test anyone who walks in for free. It's sex without using a condom. If you ask the students, they'll tell all. I was a little nervous because I have had unprotected sex with people that have been uh, HIV positive. It feels amazing just to know that everything is great. You know, it's always... You never think that you, you're in that position, but it's definitely great to make sure that you're not. Proud to share their negative status and help spread awareness. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, more than a million people have HIV in the U.S. I'd just like to commemorate him here today. At noon, students and staff hosted a vigil remembering those who lost their battle. They breathed positivity into their balloons and released it into the air. Once the balloon was deflated, the pins over their hearts stood as a reminder, hoping it will encourage others to get tested so if someone does test positive, they can get treatment before it's too late. For more information on HIV testing and awareness, head online to abc2news.com. At Coppin State University, Cassie Carlisle, ABC2 News.